Some dogs have been bred to be more tolerant of cold weather. They may have thick, insulating double coats and bushy tails designed to be wrapped around their faces to keep them cozy. Their paws are often wide and covered in snow-repelling fur, and their ears tend to be small to prevent frostbite. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. Exclamation mark. Here is a list of breeds that thrive in cold weather conditions. 1. Siberian Husky. When you think of snow dogs, undoubtedly, the popular Siberian Husky will be at the top of most people's lists. They are known for their energy and endurance, their thick coat, and their ability to cope with sub-zero temperatures. All of these qualities make them excellent sled dogs. While they are friendly and intelligent, they can be rather intense, are often prolific howlers and require a lot of exercise. As with many of the breeds on this list, they are also prolific shedders when their coat is molting. 2. Newfoundland. The gentle and fluffy Newfie was originally bred to support Canadian fishermen negotiating the icy waters of the North Atlantic. They helped with hauling the fishing nets and were known to dive into the waters to rescue those that fell overboard. They continue to be used for water rescue now. Despite their size, their shedding, and their propensity to drool excessively, they are a popular companion breed because of their calm and loving natures. 3. Finnish Laphand. The Finnish Laphand is a Nordic breed developed to help move herds of reindeer across the tundra of Lapland in the Arctic Circle. Finnies have an incredibly thick double coat and a distinctive curled tail that can be wrapped around their face to keep snow away and provide warmth. This breed thrives on company and, while they can be a little wary of strangers, they are a friendly and energetic and remain popular in their native Finland. This in spite of them being prolific shedders and rather vocal. 4. Akita. The Akita is the largest of the six ancient Spitz-type breeds that are native to Japan, and they retain great cultural significance to this day. They are thought to be a symbol of contentment and longevity. The breed was initially developed as a watchdog and hunter in the cold mountainous regions of the country. They are always fiercely loyal, noble and quiet, but can be wary of strangers, strong-willed and don't always get on with other dogs. Akitas, like many dogs bred to live in cold climates, have webbed toes, helping to distribute their weight better when walking on snow and ice. 5. Kishand. The Kishand is another Spitz-type dog, but this breed doesn't originate from a country associated with such extreme cold weather conditions. They are native to the Netherlands where they acted as companions and watchdogs for the barges on the Dutch canals. On the waterways, they often had to be out on top of the barge for long periods of time in all weather conditions, and their dense double coat kept them snug. They are known for being friendly, affectionate dogs with plenty of stamina. 6. Samoyed. The ancient Samoyed originates from Russia, where they had to cope with freezing temperatures working as hunters, herders and sled dogs for the semi-nomadic Siberian people the Samoyed. Their owners would also invite them into their tents to help keep them warm through the freezing nights. They are known for being gentle and forming strong bonds with their families. They do need a lot of attention and can develop problem behaviors or separation anxiety without this. 7. Alaskan Malamute. Alaskan Malamutes are often confused with Siberian Huskies. A Malamute, however, is bigger and stronger, but not as high energy. They also often develop stronger bonds with their owners and are a more companionable breed. They are not a pack dog and don't always enjoy the company of other dogs as much as a husky will. Bred by the Malemiut Inuit tribe from Alaska for hundreds of years, they were able to pull heavy sleds over long distances and in frigid temperatures. 8. Finnish Spitz. You may have noticed there aren't many small breeds on this list. The smaller the dog, the harder it tends to be for them to retain their body heat. The Finky, as they are often affectionately referred to, however, is a small, hardy hunting breed. They had to cope with the harsh conditions thrown at them in Finland. Known for being amiable, fun-loving and full of energy, they also tend to be rather vocal and can have a high prey drive. 9. Great Pyrenees. 
The dignified and calm Great Pyrenees was originally bred, hundreds of years ago, to guard livestock in the mountainous Pyrenees region between France and Spain. To this day, they are still used for this job. In the winter, temperatures in the mountains plummet, and the pier's exceptionally thick coat allowed them to stay out watching over their flock through the night. Despite their size, they are known for being gentle and loyal towards their family. Early socialization and ongoing training are required, though to make sure their watchdog and barking instincts do not get out of control. 10. Chow Chow. The Chow Chow is certainly a head turner. With their majestic ruff around their face and their unique blue-black tongue, they can't help but attract admirers. This ancient Chinese breed was originally used to guard the sacred temples erected in the freezing mountainous northern steppes regions that connected Mongolia, Siberia, and China. Their exceptionally thick coat kept them warm while performing this task. Nowadays they are known for generally being loyal but independent, low energy and calm companion dogs. They can be aloof with strangers and don't always get along with other dogs. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.